second screen, social media and Big Brother in 3D. These are three things that the first day of the TV in Can, the big industry event, have offered today, the first day. And it's clear that the TV industry is really, really scared of the rise of the internet. Uh, there's been a huge buzz about second screen solutions. And as one person tweeted, there are no second screen. There are only screens. But it's clear that the TV industry, even though uh, most channels see, uh, see that 70% that or more that of their viewers are still on traditional TV, it's no doubt that they feel the cold winds of the rising internet. Uh, and social media uh, has, is also a big buzz. Viewer interaction. Uh, one person talked about the, the control room of the future where social media is an in integral part of TV production where the control room in the TV studio can use social media turn it around and get it out with extra added content to the regular TV screen. And she asked what are the jobs in the future of the new TV, uh, new TV control room, which is a very interesting question. Another thing we, see, we, we have heard uh, talk about is the new monitoring and big data solutions that can give broadcasters and TV producers uh, good holds of whether a character is uh, popular or not, uh, whether it should remain in the series or be written out, uh, who should win, and basically all around how to promote and make their content more and more popular. So big data solutions has been talked at the startup track here in, in uh, Cam a lot. And to wrap this up, uh, if you didn't think Big Brother could get worse, it can. Uh, Big Brother in 3D, half-naked ladies and young men in 3D in Brazil. Um, so when a show is going downhill, just add 3D and you're set right. This is Annika Lidne, uh, co-founder of Dramatify in Cannes at MIP TV. Stay tuned for more content tomorrow. Bye bye.